focused on the private sector and these multinational corporations, pharmaceutical companies particularly, and successful entrepreneurs. So the Democrats, uh, Senator Wyden, uh, Finance Committee said he'll consider subpoenas, hearings, and bills to light a fire under some of these targets. Let's go to the next slide. If you don't believe me, this is what happened this week. There were two hearings aimed at successful entrepreneurs. They were not limited to family-owned businesses, but they talked some about that, about wealthy people who made uh, their, their, their fortune on their own. Four senators urging Treasury to take specific actions that say, they say, you have authority to limit the abuse of trust by the ultra-wealthy. You can see some of the specific uh, items that they said that they hoped that Treasury would do. They focused this one on grantor trust and uh, gift and estate taxes, but they might be sending letters on other ones. This administration takes those ideas seriously. They're going to increase audits. So there was $45 billion originally allocated to, in the IRA legislation to enforcement. Janet Yellen said, we're, we're not going to use any of that money on people earning less than $450,000. Well, who does that leave? Big corporations already are audited every year. So that means that they're going after individuals who are earning more than $400,000 a year. And they have a lot of money to do it. Now, it will take them a while to ramp up. But you can be assured your chances of being audited by the IRS are going up dramatically over the next year.